Okay, I am back to flying. We are in Grand Nebraska as ATC starts up. Looking around here, that way out the passenger and the driver's side window. That is Grand Island, Nebraska. So off to the left is Central Nebraska Regional Airport. So I guess they consider this to be central Nebraska. I think we're about 200 miles from the Iowa border, Omaha. And when you look at it on the map, it doesn't look like central Nebraska. It looks more like uh, towards eastern Nebraska, but whatever. We still got a long ways to go. I'm not sure just how much uh, longer I'm gonna fly today. I'm hoping to make it to the Iowa border least make it a little bit further. So that's what we got going on. Going to one one nine or decimal for generic for hotel box truck. So we're getting up here near the Silver Creek area. I've been flying for quite a long time. That river over there is the Plot, P-L-A-T-T-E River, Plate River, Black River. Yeah, as you can see, it's just boring out here, just flat and boring. This has been one heck of a long stretch. As you can see, a really long stretch. Got, still got quite a ways to go before we be getting into anything exciting. We'll be coming into Columbus, uh, Nebraska. It's going to be our first big town, and we'll have to do a little bit turn in here and there and get on a different freeway and then get back off to the 30, but that's going to be a ways away. Okay, I kind of flew a little off course. I was too busy studying Google figure out where I was, and I almost flew past where 30 makes a pretty good right. There's also a train track down there. You see it's going to go straight, but we have to make this turn 30. We're going to go down here so far, and we've got to make another really sharp turn, and then another one after that once we are in the town. So Anyway, we're about to pass over a speedway. It's called US 30 Speedway for whatever kind of racing cars they have. And it does not look like uh, <laughs> it does on Google Earth, but I, uh, I should check it out. There's quite a bit of difference. <laughs> anyway, so, anyway, we'll get down here a little farther. Make, making that left hand sharp left hand turn on 30. Alright, here is a sharp, sharp corner. Alright, here 30 is going to continue on across the river. It's not going to be too far and we'll be right in the center of town. We just passed over a pretty big train track and I think I just went too far. Let's just go ahead and circle around. And if I forgot to mention it, this is Columbus. Columbus, Nebraska, right? Just over Nebraska. Okay, yeah, it was a really short distance. Directly below me is a pretty good train yard. And I need to... You know, I am all fouled up, so... Uh, Let's circle back around and continue the way we were. Because, uh, I got all flubbed up here, so we need to continue on for this. Maybe I should just remove that out of the video. 
Okay, so we're going to continue on, and I don't think that's where I needed to turn. If we get out here and run into an airport, then we went too far. It is really hard to tell. I cannot tell where 30 makes a left, makes a right, makes a left and a right. I do believe I have went too far already. I just missed it. It just goes too fast. And everything runs together. There's the airport right there. I'm not lost. I know where I'm at. I just can't find my way back to the 30 until I get to the airport. I'm going to have to swing right over the airport. I'm sure. ATC would yell at me like no other for doing this. But this is the only way I can tell where the 30's going to be at. The 30's going to be right at the end of this. So, would my pilot's license be taken away here for doing something this stupid? It better be. <laughs> In reality, I'm talking about I don't have a pilot's license. And you can probably say, yeah, we know. We've been watching your videos for a while. Okay, so now we're back to the 30. There we are. There's the 30 right there. Oh, oh my goodness. That point's over. So now we're back to the 30. Okay, so I am definitely back on the 30 now. I did uh, do a quick save of the game in case the airport back there wants to shoot me down for pulling such a bonehead move. <laughs> That I did. Anyway, I guess they're not going to do it. I got away with it. So we're coming up on rich land. Okay, we are passing through the small little community of Ames. I did get lost for a bit. I got myself back on track thanks to the river road. Okay, we are now east of Fremont, and you can perhaps see how the road actually. Interstate 30 goes around the town. I don't know why they did it that way. But they did. And now we're going to be coming up on another small town called Arlington. That same as the place in Washington. I guess. Or Arlington, Delaware, I guess. Okay, we are about to pass through the small community of Kennard. And next. Next to think way up there is going to be Blair, I do believe. Okay, as you can see, we are almost to Missouri Valley. The intersection is the right mouse. The intersection is right in front of the plane. I'm going to end up at this point. Look ahead really quick here. I will need to take a right turn at that big intersection and then go down maybe a mile and a half or two miles, make a left, and I'll be on the 8th peak. That will take us all the way through to Davenport. I don't know if I'll have to switch freeways, but it doesn't. Uh, the point will be right in between. So we are now in Iowa. So I'm going to end this video here. I am pretty darn tired. I got all the way to Iowa. So if you enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe. And I'll see you next time. Thanks for watching.